<laughs> I'm a ghost. How do I go through walls? Oh, that'd be the worst life as a ghost. It's like, can't even go through walls. <laughs> That's even the point then. This game is all about the necromancer. Health, I'm a ghost, but I don't know how to. F <laughs> Fuck <God. laughs> I can't get out of the elevator. Game facts, how do I no clip? <laughs> ghost, I can't no clip. You can't open the console in real life. I'm gonna soul keep this one. Finally got the guy behind him. What the fuck? Oh, they ripped my projectiles. Oh, rip me. Rip me. <laughs> rip me! <laughs> He's what the? What? <laughs> we, we lost? <laughs> yeah, I got pinned in the elevator by a fucking Hell Knight. I, yeah, I saw that, but then I died again to... I, I think I I think I think necromancered myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the way I'd want to go down. Oh, uh, I don't know if I still keep anymore. <laughs> I do. Oh. I like the way you think. Oh, fuck that noise. That's what I was trying to do at the beginning, and then, like, I, I as I said, I necromancered myself. <laughs> Alright, now I got myself cube. Fuck that kid. Rip. Spawn camp and me? Do you know who I am? The only time we've ever died. Well, well no. We've died plenty of times. Well, yeah. Wait, th this door looks like it's- look at this door. It looks like there's no greenness on it. See? But it opens. Yeah, it's looks like red on the outside. The game's a liar. Maybe by just full setting it's actually open. The ammo. Damn it, why can't I pick up the fucking power hammer? Power jack. Power jack hammer? hammer? Sorry, I went, I went 40k. You went, you went full space again. marines. What? Space marines. Yes. I'm glad you knew that time. Alright, well, as I said, I know of it. Uh, we've already listened to Robert Cody. Oh, looks like you're having fun up there. I'll leave you be. Thanks. I got shit to loot here. This plasma ammo. Hey, we're in Egypt. Hey, it's a necromancer. <laughs> we're, we're in Egypt. <laughs> Hydro hydroglyphs. I dubbed that. Uh, I dubbed this necromancer uh, priestly. Oh. <laughs> oh, this one's. <laughs> Rip. Don't put him in the fire. Ah. Oh. <laughs> That's what you get. <laughs> Uh, I went while I learned. Oh, there's another one up here. Dude, there's, there's a fucking necromancer just chilling up here. And by the way, ha a hierarchy. Ha have fun up there. I'm just gonna help you support you with the BFG. Same as the necromancer up here. Oh, God, there is. Yeah, right here. Did you really in that one? This is gonna be, um, uh, sc Sky Necro. Uh. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. Oh god, oh god, oh god! It, it put me in a position where I couldn't aim at him anymore. Jesus Christ, I people turn on the lights! <laughs> Ken, one upstairs. Ken the, the, the golden rule of this game is if you do anything, anything at all, it fucking triggers monsters. Like, all I did was look at this and I'm like, oh, lights on? Sure! I'm gonna turn them off now. Fuck you. What the hell? Did what, what is it? Where is the power on lights? I don't know. I don't see any difference. Maybe it's a trap. Okay, so we got a storage room key. Is that the one back here? You go look. I think it is, because things are spawning here. Well, I almost killed myself. I think it is for over here somewhere. Alright. Yep. Oh, look, we got the storage room and fuck that. 
There's a necromancer there with explosive barrels. Oh, so keep dying, yeah. Yeah. I love Soul Cube. There we go. Why is the mine triggering? So, what, what, what is the storage room uh, necromancer going to be? Hmm. Not I'm sure. Uh, you know what? It's dweeby as fuck, but reset. There you go. What? Reset. You won't get it. Reset. Someone. Reset. Reset. Alright, uh, there's, there's some more, uh, okay. There's some more, uh, uh, spiders over here to get your soul cube back. Where are you? The clarifying it's that weeaboo item shop game. Uh. Like you've heard of it, right? No. Let's just say I did. Oh. Uh, oh, I know what the one you're talking Yeah, that is pretty weeaboo, you piece of shit. God. Well, it makes sense. It's storerooms, items. Are you sure you don't already right? have the soul cube, by the way? Maybe you have it and you just you don't know you're. But it's not it. showing. Uh, I'll try, I guess. Adrenaline. Lights on. Lights on. There we go. A plus Fuck that's, I had it the entire time. Uh, Worth I, it. I told you. Oh, it only gave me like twenty. <laughs> well, spider arenas. So it is based upon the health. I told you. Oh yeah, yeah I'll let you get your thing back. <laughs> we'll have it back already. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Oh no. Oh, there's armor shards up there. I need those. Huh? I actually didn't know those were there. <laughs> I, I don't really need them, though, because now the, the fucking armor's just melting off me. It's too hot in here. It really is. Can't oh. handle all the sunscreen. Oh god, it's fucking video discs. Oh, let's just kill this guy. I'm gonna sort keep one and kill the other. Go ahead, I'm not killing you anymore. Well. Oh god. I, I was trapped by the ladder. The ladder would not unhand me. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna go watch the video log. Try not to trigger anything while I'm in, uh, in there. No promises. Uh, tablets. Alright, Ancient Civilization? I got two videos, I think. Uh, yeah, I'll listen to them both then. This is Dr. Pierce Rock. Oh, no, 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 we know about that one. Okay, just tablets then. Setting new standards in both archaeological discovery and analysis, the UAC is proud to showcase the latest findings on four unique and fascinating artifacts. These tablets were originally discovered in the dig site under what has become known as Site 3. Subsequent examination of the surrounding area and carbon dating of the tablets brought UAC researchers to the conclusion that the tablets belonged to a civilization that existed millennia ago and were placed in a holy burial ground of some sort. Utilizing the best minds in linguistics and UAC proprietary pattern recognition software, the tablets were exhaustively examined. What we found was fantastic. The first tablet provided us with a wealth of scientific data specifically detailing the mathematical concepts behind teleportation. UAC researchers use this information as the cornerstone for building the Delta teleportation devices. The second and third tablets illustrate an epic story, a story of war, and how, faced with impossible odds, the ultimate sacrifice of an entire race to achieve victory. The fourth tablet details how the essence of each individual was captured and placed in the artifact we now refer to as the Soul Cube. This device was wielded by their mightiest warrior, and with it he banished the invading horde forever. Our researchers are still analyzing a recently found hidden section of the fourth stone and some related fragments. It goes into detail on the invading force and indicates the remaining survivors may have teleported somewhere. Where we do not know, although it seems to reference a map we have yet to locate. To date, there remains no evidence of any type of invasion at any of the sites. Our assumption is that time has removed all but what we now see. The tablets referenced the original Doom. They had the original Doom cover with the Soul Cube on it. 
It, like that's what the Doom guy was holding. With, he was holding the soul cube instead of like a weapon. Well then. Yeah, that was kind of awkward. There, there really is two video discs, but I don't know what the second one is. Let me see. Have a look. There, there isn't one. It's the, the that one we've gotten before, and, uh, and then I have the. Oh yeah, it's one. civilizations, right? Yeah. Anyways, okay, let's keep going then. Man, I like. I also, there's a actually there's a health station back here, but I couldn't use it. Oh, where? Oh shit! There's a guy here. Oh, I can use it now. Yeah, I'll, I'll just handle what's coming from this side. Only I have 99 health. Use us. So where's the health station? Right here. Oh, oh neat. You have to stun it at like an awkward angle, but you can use it. Cool. And we have lots yeah. of lives. Wait, your My health will keep the next thing. Your health is 33, I was just about to say. Just want to add the soul keep though. That's fine. Have fun. Oh, I heard him. Where are you at? Up. Why are you shotgunning him? He's like all the way up there. These are, these are video games. He's in rage. Right? What? Someone else is saying destroy him. Oh shit, I missed. Oh no, I didn't. Thanks a nice lot, dick. Nice dick, G-shot nerd. <laughs> Rude! I, I can rocket jump you. <laughs> Let's go up there. Yeah. Wait, yeah. you rocket jump yourself? Yeah. I can what did you find up there? Oh, there's literally nothing here. Except for like my low health. <laughs> Alright, time to solve well, something. Did it. The hell are these spiky ball things? Oh, right. I remember now. Oh, look, it is. Oh, there's two of them. I used up all my BFG ammo, I fly. Fuck, I wanna leave. Oh, I wanna get off! <laughs> he just gets mad at Oh god! Negative 99 health. Fucking physics! Get wrecked? Dude, every time. Why is it always the physics that kills you? I don't know. But at least there's adrenaline here so I can run through this entire place. I hate the physics. Well, I did the boss. Oh, okay. Well, thanks. You proud to be dead? It's, it's not like I wanted to see him die or anything, Senpai. That's Senpai, it's Baka. Goddamn. Oh, oh, Baka, okay. I don't even know what the fuck either of those means, but... God, don't let me explain it to you, I was like a nerd. Please, now explain it to me. Not even, not even a nerd, a weeaboo. It's worse. <sighs> senpai is like... <laughs> say you're in high school. Uh, Someone's a year above you, you call them Senpai. Oh. Uh. Why? It's, it's implying that you, they're your senior. Oh. In, like, academics. I, I, but did, not, I did not even know that. And, and, and Baka is just idiot. And suddenly, a little bit of my soul is now gone. <laughs> suddenly, you're slightly more weeaboo than me. Yeah. Oh. Okay, this, is this, like, constantly shaking for you, too? Yeah. Like, I'm standing right here, it's just fucking doom intensifies. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, come on. Let's go get all the ammo and shit. Okay, right. I, I, I don't really know what to do here. Oh, we just... We turned it off. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> That's cool, you can do that. Ah, okay. Oh, we're done. No! What? I was gonna jump on the elevator. Oh. It's gonna be fun. No fun allowed here. We're playing Doom. So you've made it this far. I'm so glad we were looting all this time, Canned. 
it's so worthwhile. Hey man, I love walking into these rooms and like just not think of anything. Yeah, you know, it's it's. <laughs> that is why I live get for playing games for just like, huh, a loot room. I don't need anything. It's, it makes everything feel so useless. Oh, here, there's some health up here for the uh, for the health pool. Yeah, the communist pool. Yep. Yep. So, um, yeah, this, th we're definitely not fighting any kind of final boss now, huh? Definitely. It's gonna not. go in the next room. It's gonna be imps. Yep. I think it's all the loot I can pick up. You good? I guess. I mean, I want to pick up more stuff, but I can't. How much fucking ammo am I carrying around with me all the time? Fucking hell. Bearing in mind, like, we've, <laughs> like, what, four times playing this, this playthrough, we've had our ammo reset to, like, nothing? Yeah. Like, it's just, we always have lots of ammo. Oh, here we go. Oh, I already had the video thing for that. Oh wait, wait, there's a Doom Guy tablet somewhere. Where is it? Oh. This one. Fuck that place. Yeah, you see what I mean? It looks exactly like yeah. the uh... It even has like the, the guy over here. Shadows. Proprietary pattern recognition. Alright. Well, let's go. What is this? It's what? I can't even use it. Never mind. Moving on. I'm, I'm, I'm getting spooked right now, please. Uh, I have to wait for you. Okay. We. This looks more like Quake than it does fucking Doom. Right. I need to be on the lookout for something, by the way. Yeah, I, I, so, know, I know what you're looking for. It's on the left. Okay. I'm pretty sure. If I, if I see a big room, I'll be sure to not go into it. Oh, shit. Okay. So, I keep triggering the cutscene by accident, and so now we're going to meticulously go down here. Um, do not go that way. Did you see the fucking place I'm pointing to? This way? Don't go that way. Go this way. Okay. Uh, and there's an id, uh, id rock here. And I can interact with it. Da 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 da. The fuck? Was it worth it? Yep. So we have an id software PDA, and uh, th there's no audio log for it, and title game director is all access uh, from 2004, and he goes, thanks. Basically it's, um, there's John Carmack, uh, we're finally done. It's just all the uh, developers made a PDA note with emails. There's a lot of them. Like a shit ton. You hope he enjoyed you playing the game. MartianBuddy.com Oh wait, wait, one second. Please remember to... Whatever. Turbo Turkey Puncher. There's a lot. Okay, I'm not reading all these. Actually, wait, what's the one at the, bo at the bottom there? Someone say free food. Okay, never mind. The interns. Apparently something to me. Alright. So that's kind of like a, a little Easter egg at the very end. Yeah, just like a little, hey, thanks. Yeah. Totally breaking Hey, Mike! Nothing. What? Uh, I, I, I left the oven on. Is that a hell knight? Don't let me put you in the lava. <laughs> Why can't I? 
I can't I can't fucking soul cube him even though I have charges for it. So a B try. Uh, now I got it. So uh, we have to use a soul cube to basically kill this motherfucker, and that's that's pretty much the end game. So basically, like if they too. if they had decided not to send any enemies at us. Like, don't they know the fucking Soul Cube's weakness, which is the fact it needs to charge up? Maybe they don't know? <laughs> like, let's lend, let's lend lots of little guys at him that will do absolutely nothing but allow him to kill us. Oh, armor. Well, let's be honest. The hell might have fucking paid. <laughs> <laughs> the Cyber Demon can't kill us by himself. I mean, <laughs> we're too fast. Yeah, we have unlimited sprint now. The, where the fuck did it go? <laughs> did you lose the cyber demon? Yeah, apparently, apparently it doesn't auto aim onto the cyber demon. Oh, sorry, no, I mean the hell knight. I like it's how you just correct yourself there. You must have thought it seemed like a fool. I know. He looks kind of lame, and I'm also kind of following him right now. He's not exactly what I'd call a difficult boss. I think the harder boss was that trap. <laughs> he bitch slapped me. Because <laughs> I, I decided to punch him Did in the you foot. Die? I, I punched him in the foot. I'm out of stamina. I what, gotta, is this? what, I have stamina again? Because <laughs> I died. I'm slow now. <laughs> we have stamina now, which means we might die. It reset after we died. That's horrible. <laughs> we made fun of it, now we're fucking slow again. <laughs> it's like. The too fast zone. Once we get to a path fight into a juggernaut. Remember, if you go near him, he will kill you in one hit. He's having trouble pathfinding a little bit. No, I won't have fun killing him. Oh, he's still not dead. What the fuck? They're, they're spawning in like this, too. I, can, I hate to say it, but this is like really easy, and it's just because like they don't spawn in that fast, which is actually prolonging this. Use your soul cube. I uh, what if I had it? Do I have it? Use the boost to get fruit. Not yet. This is fucking taking forever. There we go. Get Maybe we should double whammy him. done you have completed this episode yay spook we did it i like how the camera passed uh, pan past the necromancers there's like three of them 
Hey everyone, so that's the end of uh, Doom 3. Uh, so, Ken, what do you think of uh, Doom 3? Terrible game. Uh, uh, not even Call of Duty, man. <laughs> well, it's. I would say it's okay. It has not aged well in the slightest. Um, that's kind of my opinion at this point. Y you were right, though. They kind of. I think they were trying to go for some kind of system shock related thing, but they did it utterly wrong. Cause it's not even survival horror at all. Um, yeah, I mean, like. You think about like one, like walking around like carrying 300 shotgun shells? It's ridiculous. Survival horror. I don't know. I mean, it isn't labeled as survival horror, but they're trying to give a system shock, system shock vibe. And system shock, you legitimately were like, well, not not for ammo, but remember, we were always like hungering for med med typos and shit. Never had enough of those. Yeah. Just, yeah. I don't know. Um. For me, though, it's it's mostly the fact that everything is uh, behind some sort of trigger. Like it's everything is like like you press a button, oh, a monster spawns behind you, and you get used to that really, really quickly. Um, and that makes the game completely unreplayable whatsoever because there isn't any kind of um, dynamic encounters. Like there, there's not like uh, monsters kind of roaming the map or whatever. They just kind of are whatever. Uh, Wait, I mean, they kind of simulate it, but like if you like get the backtrack for a level, and things spawn when you backtrack, but that's still scripted. It, yeah, it's all scripted. Like it's just that you're meant to backtrack, and that's that's you know you're going the right way. But if you go into an area where things aren't spawning, you know you aren't going the right way, which is kind of dumb. I don't know. I'm not. As I said, it's it's completely off track of what uh, what the original Doom games were. Uh, it's its own entity within itself. Uh, probably didn't need to be called Doom uh, at all. They could have called it something else, but I don't know. They probably want to go and whatever. Not uh, not a word of successor. And this music is really fucking loud. Let me go turn that down. Alright, is it quieter now? Can I talk? Yeah, now you can. Go ahead. Alright. I was going to say, like, it just took a different direction. I mean, I wouldn't say it's a bad game. Like... I enjoyed playing this now, I enjoyed playing this way back when. Will I play it again for a while? Probably not, but I still think it's a good game. I, I, well, I think it was better that we did it in co-op, because honestly for me, I, I'm i pretty familiar with all the spooks and like I, I expect it. And so I think it was just funnier just to play it in co-op, even though it's not necessarily a, appropriate as a cooperative game because of the fact that... As you saw. Well, it's it's you know it's it becomes a little bit easier, but it's it's more entertaining that way at least for me. Um, I mean, we did have some difficulty near the end on against some of the monsters and shit. So, you know, there's there's some there is some difficulty to be had, I guess. But uh, it's it's clearly not designed to be co-op. Well, neither was the original Doom, but we kind of did that as well um, in co-op. Just because that was kind of it just made it more fun, you know. I don't know. Well, we also played original Doom and Brutal Doom, which made the game harder anyway, so it was fine. And we played it as dirty scrubs with infinite respawns. Yeah. Well, well, this one I, I we couldn't really set it. Well, this one was set up a little bit better, just to that that universal health pool, which added some, a little bit, of like we had to try rather than just get through the level, but you know. But even then, as you saw, like for a lot of the times, we just no problem with the levels. Like 600 in the health pool, it's like, oh, we got six extra lives. Like, we started having trouble when we had to rely on the soul cube. <laughs> Fucking soul cube. Because your co-op partners can fuck you over and everything. It's the worst. Oh, well. I don't know. It's uh, We will be doing uh, Resurrection of Evil uh, at some point. Um, I don't know, not immediately, but it's on the list. Um, you could expect it. And as for Doom 4, uh, I know some people want to see that. Uh, I, I will probably do that on, on its release, because I am interested in Doom games. I want to see if they they went back to the... Um, if they actually did something with the formula that's any good. Although, Carmack, I don't think, has much to do with it anymore. Um, uh, but Carmack is more of the kind of programming genius behind a lot of the technology around the uh, id's engines. Yeah, he makes the engines, doesn't he? Well, doesn't, not him himself, personally, but you know what I mean. He doesn't really decide upon necessarily how the game is. But, you know, uh, Carmack has a lot of good design philosophies, though. Like, he was the one... He basically said, uh, 
you know, he goes like, uh, he believes in like he should be able to mash enter a couple times when you start a game and then get right into the game without any kind of like just it loads in and that's it. Uh, opposed to like these long intro levels and stuff that this game had. So like, you know, as I said, I don't think he gets a say anymore. Well, uh, he doesn't work there anymore, so obviously he doesn't get a say anymore. Uh, but I, I'm I'm sa I'm kind of sad that he doesn't get you know to, like he clearly didn't have anything really to he just worked on the technology for this game I'm guessing and not really the actual design. But there's a lot of people like uh, Romero and whatever that had a lot to do with the Doom games that don't do anything for it anymore. So uh, will Doom Four uh, live up to our expectations? I guess we'll uh, we'll see. But I, I'm I'm gonna be the pessimistic one and say it probably won't. But we'll see. You know maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised. You know, so. I mean, I'd like to enjoy Doom 4. <laughs> well, I did enjoy this. Like, it wasn't bad, but, you know, it's, it's, you know, if, it's not Doom, though. So. Yeah. That's, that's all I can really say for that. Oh, well. That was fun, though. I think it's looping. It is looping. <laughs> You're watching the credits, too? Yeah, just, why not? Uh, okay. Get in the mood. All right, well, uh, everyone, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, we'll see you later. Bye. Tati bye. Rip. Rip.